Suryan Chandra and together with Mustafa Al Sayed, we founded Automata five months ago. Automata is a robotics company and our goal is to democratize robotics through a low-cost hardware platform and easy-to-use software. If you're out to get a robot today, you would have to spend fifty or sixty thousand dollars. But that's where we fit in. Our first product is a robotic arm called Eva. Unlike industrial robots that are heavy and expensive, Eva is low cost and lightweight. She's made out of plastic, so it weighs just 2.2 kilos and she retails for $3,000. Eva can pick up 750 grams when it's fully outstretched and it can pick up about a kilo in a more recessed position. The software is called Choreograph and we have made the software so simple you can practically do it without any programming. You can literally physically move the robot from one point to the other and it records the motion and it just plays it back flawlessly. Most big manufacturers have very well-defined automated pipelines and very controlled environments where robots are already deployed. But many small manufacturers have specialized machines where a human has to load and unload a machine. And we've designed Eva such that she's ideal for these kind of situations. At this price point, we are also opening up robotics to whole new markets. For example, one of the areas where we ourselves need a process automation is currently all our prototypes are 3D printed. So one of the tasks that was extremely painful for us was to come in at 3 in the morning or 6 in the morning to take out prints from the printer and put the next print on. And that's something we are able to automate using our robot. We've been through about 16 hardware iterations and since the company started about five months ago. We use Fusion quite a bit for our 3D modeling and optimizing for 3D printing. Whenever we discover that something needs to be changed, for us we quickly remodel it, we 3D print it, and the next day we have the part fitted in the robot functioning. That is exactly what has enabled us to move so fast. Just like how 3D printing has enabled us to do what we've done in the last six months, we see us becoming such enablers of technology to other people where we enable people to do more with fewer resources. Today, every design studio has a 3D printer. Soon, we hope to get to the point where every design studio has a robotic arm.